Medial pontine strokes cause contralateral weakness and intranuclear ophthalmoplegia. And lateral pontine strokes cause everything else. Ipsilateral facial numbness and weakness, horizontal gaze paresis, and contralateral ataxia and hemisensory loss. If you see a patient with ataxic hemiparesis on one side, start looking for eye movement abnormalities. So we've left the lateral pons and now we're moving posterolaterally into the cerebellar peduncle and the anterior inferior cerebellum. This is the domain of the anterior inferior cerebellar artery. SCA strokes, ICA strokes can cause ipsilateral ataxia. ICA strokes can also damage some of the lateral pons. So ICA strokes can cause ipsilateral facial sensory loss and Horner syndrome. But ICA has an interesting party trick. Strokes can cause hearing loss. Well, ICA gives rise to labyrinthine artery, which supplies the inner ear. 